welcome Libra to your mid-July love reading. If you are new to my channel, welcome to Charlie Tarot and feel free to subscribe. So we are going to be looking into your love situation. We're using the AF Tarot deck for the main energy. Soul cards will be used for the main spread. And then at the end of the reading, I am going to use the um, love oracles to see what this person has to say to you, okay? <coughs> Excuse me. And we're going to see what this person is thinking um, about you, what their next move is, what you don't see coming in the potential future or outcome of the situation. Um, we're going to see how they feel, what is keeping you guys together here, and um, what the challenge is. So your cards have already been shuffled, so I'm just going to go ahead and pull out a card. First card out is the King of Wands and Readers. Ooh, we have the Sun energy. The Star Guys could be healing from something here. Six of Swords. The Magician. Eight of Swords in reverse. Seven of Cups. We have the Emperor. Wow. All right. Keep in mind, this reading may not resonate with every single one of you, so please take what resonates, okay? We have you coming up as the Three of Cups. Your person's coming up as the Nine of Swords. Ooh. Ooh. The challenge is the Tower. Page of Wands. Ace of Pentacles. Seven of Swords. Two of Wands. Four of Cups. Very passionate connection. Very, very, very passionate. There is a, oh wow, we have the Hierophant, okay. The Sun, the Hierophant, Eight of Swords. There is an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. I feel this air sign is very impulsive, could be very reckless, sharp with their tongue. Emotionally manipulative, but very like up and down, okay. We do have a challenge of the tower. So I feel that this person is having a hard time accepting um, accepting how uh, this tower, but I feel like they're resisting a lot of change. They're going against the universe here. The tower, you could have had multiple tower moments, some chaos, fights, arguments, lies, deception, betrayal, something that just, you know, it, it just keeps happening. It's like this person is operating like a tower moment. They are the tower, a walking tower moment. The king of wands in reverse is very arrogant, um, selfish, you know, bratty behavior. It's not a king when it's in reverse. It's more of like needing some type of control. It's a very weak leader. Okay, very weak. This is a very insecure energy you dealt with. Lots of chemistry and passion though. I feel you are taking your power back, taking back your mind too. Someone is um, having a hard time moving on mentally, but that's okay. I feel like the star is here to show you that, hey, there's some type of awakening. There's a lot of healing here. There's a renewal coming into your life. Continue going after your wish fulfillments. There could be some cloudiness or, um, or energy here or other opportunities that are being presented to you. Um, so it's be So I feel like as you're manifesting, make sure you're manifesting something that is going to bring you up not down okay you have a lot of power here you're coming up as a magician so you can really have anything you want here libra i mean manifest anything you can manifest another king of wands in reverse if you wanted to i'm just saying you can manifest anything a lot of positivity or a lot of negativity the thing is is that the magician has all the tools um all of the tools on how to overcome things, how to bring things in um, into your life. You have a lot of power. The Three of Cups is you coming in as the as compassionate, hmm, having fun, and as you're having fun, or however, 
this per or you know just being more sociable and kind of maybe hanging out with friends maybe going out maybe doing something this person's getting really angry this person could think that you have a third party there is a, an energy of messages here curiosity and the mutual energy so kind of like curious um, this person I feel is wanting a, a, an opportunity with you something solid but their actions are too sneaky to to be solid with you they want you committed but they don't want but they want to be sneaky that makes no sense their actions no that's not going to work for Libra two of wands is making a choice on what you don't see coming feeling at a crossroads this is already making the choice though you already know what you have to do it's just now taking action all right the outcome is showing the four of cups this could also be boredom for some of you guys but this also feels like a missed opportunity this person could feel that you know you're going to be a missed opportunity but i do feel like there is an energy of just choosing yourself in the end which i feel that's what you're going towards anyways this person could act like they want to water this pentacle with you and help it grow and be something more but in reality it's just for them they want you committed to them because their intentions are untrustworthy I do feel like you are closing out this cycle from a reckless energy, selfish, reckless. I mean, no, the world is here to show you that you're closing out a cycle. Okay. You're having some type of an awakening, making a choice, no longer confused, seeing this person for what they are, seven of swords, no more feeling confused because confusion causes setbacks. It causes you to be in your head and I don't feel like you're doing that I feel like you're releasing the trap feeling you're no longer feeling trapped because you're having an awakening you're being more disciplined with your life with your emotions you're seeing through this energy you're taking action you have a lot of wisdom the awakening is coming in and it's beautiful okay with the star this person can never have a control of the Emperor never you're holding that Emperor energy male or female does not matter now let's clarify a little bit see what's coming in nine of swords yeah this person wants to message you they're very curious okay but they have very self-limiting beliefs but they could come off just kind of wanting to know where you stand you could be silent really not showing them any um um what's that word attention not too much you're kind of coming up as a myst um, uh, mysterious to them <clears throat> three of cups they really i feel like you just like threw them off track a bit yeah two of cups wow queen of pentacles i like this you guys could be in a relationship or attracting new connections here but either way i do feel like there is a a um a feeling of either like breaking up with someone or detaching from a very strong connection uh, this could also be, you know, a lot of disharmony, but I feel with the two of cups right now, there is some unity that is coming in. This could be friendships too. It doesn't, it's just a, a, a mutual connection here, a close bond. So you guys could be, um, coming in with that energy with someone else. Also, there is a warning here since the towers in the challenge, this could be somebody trying to drag you in and kind of bring up. Uh, which is making you feeling a little bit magnetic towards them again but i feel you're very stable you're grounding yourself okay yeah perseverance all right this is like a test of faith yeah someone could be tempting you right now we did have the knight of wands coming in someone's on the pursuit but again this is a knight they want to put the effort in but with the knight of wands it's very wishy-washy okay this is like a fiery energy fire sign lots of fire lots of action i'm but i feel the moment that you give in to this person there may be a feeling of a fear of the seven of swords happening again okay like being just uh being lied to again being betrayed them going back to the same old way um and that's what I feel like this person wants to come in and then they go out. They tell you they make you feel good one day and then they make you not feel good the next. Opportunity. Oh, I guess this person really wants to try to get you back in a way, Libra. And I feel it's because you're healing. 
you're coming out of um, their game because now you have the control of the game. You're coming up very powerful. This person's constantly waiting for you. I don't care if they if you, if you see it or not. They're always wanting your attention. They want your attention in a bad way or a good way. It doesn't matter as long as they get Libra's attention. Their intentions is not good though. Two of Wands. Yep, Two of Wands again. Still at a crossroads. Feeling like you're needing to make a choice. Um, it's it's future planning, preparing to leave a situation. Should I stay or should I go? Yeah, there's still a feeling of hope possibly, which can keep you from moving forward. But your intuition, your 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 magician within you, I'm telling you, you could go either way. You're able to get yourself in and out of situations, no problem. Okay, because the magician has the power right now. It's just too many burdens, too much extra, uh, like, I don't feel like you're wanting to add, like, carry this anymore. Yep, and that's why I feel you're moving on. Eight of Cups, yeah, too much betrayal. You don't want to feel this. You could only go up from here. Then we have the Fool. Are you kidding me? Wow, victory. Moving on. Six of Swords. The star is bringing in a lot of healing for you guys, okay? So you're going to be seeing synchronicities like crazy. This person could have, you know, create <clears throat> a lot of betrayal, made you feel like you were stabbed in the back, left you places like, like left you like bleeding out in the cold in a way, okay? Like they, they wounded you deep to the point where you're at the Ten of Swords and walking away. Like you already saw a side that you cannot unsee. There's too much betrayal, but you could only go up from here. You are going to get stronger from here. You're moving and healing. Okay. So healing is a huge thing right now that the fool is you taking that leap of faith, being free spirited, not taking this person like seriously. There's too many fire, fire energy, not emotions anymore. The emotional disconnect is what's happening in the outcome. Okay, and I feel you getting control of your mind. The hope is what can keep you stuck, though. That little tiny bit of a hope that maybe this time will work. No, no. The fool is coming in. You Maybe you'll see it again. <laughs> For some of you, maybe you're like, okay, I'll take this message. I'll see you again. And they still act the same. The um, six of wands is you coming out of this victorious. Okay, you're I mean, coming up from this badass energy. This is you having, you know, a lot of self-confidence. I mean, you're just, you're good. So this person really messed up and they're not able to get a hold of you anymore. I don't feel in the outcome you're moving on. It's like, bye. Emotionally moved on. Mentally bit hard right now. Okay. That's, that's crazy that the emotions are going away. But the mental, because you're just so powerful. Your mind, the brain is powerful, right? So I feel once the emotion goes away, there's still like the mental part that is uh, staying. Is it, You're releasing that though. Releasing any fears or any blockages. Let's see what this person has to say. Secrets and deception. Yep. Yep. Seven of Swords. You make me want to be a better person. I dive in and out of relationships. Yeah, but no one compares to you. And you already know that, Libra. You already know it's going to be their loss, not yours. Please forgive me. There was someone interfering in our relationship. I will find my way back to you. Nope. Well, I feel like I can't give you what you need. Yeah, because it's a one-sided relationship. This person is inconsistent. They're immature. You know, there's too much secrets and de um, deception. There could be substance. There could be so many things wrong, you know, with this person on why it did not work out or working out. But I feel you're coming up as a musician. You know what you have to do, okay? And you will choose yourself in the end, regardless how long that may be for you. You will, because you're going. I'm telling you, you're you're coming up on top here. I promise, you are. Okay, and then let's grab the lovers of oracles. Freedom, look at freedom. And then we have the rainbow with the lotus flower. 
I love this. There is nothing stopping you. The path is clear if you want it to be. Yes. Love this reading. You guys are very powerful beings, I swear. I love my Libras. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and leave it here. If you guys do like this message or if it helped or resonated in any way, please like and subscribe. And I will see you guys very soon. God bless.